Hi everyone, it's Thursday, January 29th, and there are 281 days until Rockstock. update today has not been an epic fail it's pretty good <laughs> um and here's why so today i remembered to go to class i um remembered to go to my doctor's appointment and i gave blood and didn't even pass out jealous i know you're jealous <laughs> finally <laughs> i am um, needed this day to go smoothly. I've had a really crappy week. Um, I didn't, it's just been crappy. I'm really hating school right now. Um, it's not really often that I can actually say that I actually really, really hate school. Um, but this semester is just bad. Um, but it's a quarter of the way over. Four weeks in now. Four weeks out of 16, so I can make it. I just really don't like it right now at all. And I feel like I'm too old to be here, and I feel like I just want to graduate. And it doesn't help that one of my classes is a is like a freshman course that I never took. So I just feel like I just I'm just too old, and I don't want to do it anymore. Um, and it's keeping me really busy, and it's stressing me out a lot. And that's awesome, not really. So I wanted to readdress the question that we had to answer last week um, because I I took it as a Harry Potter fandom moment. And that's still, I still really enjoyed those two moments in the fandom. But I think if I could, if it was just like Harry Potter moment in general, like books, like everything, um, I want to go ahead and say that um, when I was reading, I think I was on like the third and fourth book by this point because I read, I read books one through six in like a period of like three weeks or something like when I read them because I just devoured them. But um, when I was reading books, two and three or three and four um my grandfather was really sick um and we had to take him to a hospital in um raleigh north carolina we had to take him to duke medical center because they were like you know the best at um his illness and he had to have this really intense surgery that was like 14 hours long and it was over my christmas break and um everyone of like my aunts and uncles and my parents um that had jobs had to go back to work and um, so basically since I was the college kid who didn't have like who had a longer winter break I had to stay with my grandmother um, in a hotel room near the hospital for a week and um, it was just it was very it was not a, it was not a happy bright time in my life because um, we would go we would sit you know at his bedside all day and then we would go back and go to sleep and then do the whole thing over um, but I think it was that week that I picked up the third book, which is my favorite book, and I just, um, it was just so wonderful, and I loved that I could, like, open this book, and I wasn't sitting, you know, by my unconscious grandfather's side. I was at Hogwarts, and that was, um, I think that was my favorite thing that happened to me in this whole series, because it, I mean, one, it just got me through this time that was just crappy, um, but two, like, I just, it made me love it that much more um, because I could like open it up and I would just go to Hogwarts and I would um, hang out with Harry and Hermione and was not in a hot in a crappy hospital room. Um, that was also the time when I bought I think that the fourth movie had just come out on DVD and um, so when I was done reading and I couldn't get a new book I would just put the movies back in and um, that was like that really like cemented I think that was the thing that like cemented my love for Harry Potter in general like I was just wonder I just I like it a lot so that is my favorite Harry Potter moment um, the moment that really made me love like made me love Harry Potter forever it's why it's so special to me on a related note of my love of Harry Potter I when I was giving blood today um, I ran into some friends some of my sorority sisters were there and so I was reading Harry a history while I was giving blood because I still haven't finished it and um, 
I picked it up to go to like the juice table where you get your snacks and your juice after you're done. And so one of my sisters was there and she was like, Julian, what are you reading? And I was like, it's about Harry Potter. And she was like, I thought so. <laughs> she was like, I saw Harry on the front and I was just like, it's about Harry Potter. So, um, news of my little love obsession thing is getting out and it makes me laugh and everyone's really cool about it and they're really nice. But it's really funny that like it used to be that like two people that are like my normal friends knew and she was just like, I thought it was Harry Potter and it was just, it was cute. And she was like, well, what's it about? So I talked to her about it and, um, it was just, it made me laugh, it made me laugh. Um, so on that note, I'm going to go. Fran, I'm not going to punish you. I wouldn't have even known that your video was late, um, because I haven't gotten, been able to have a free moment to go on YouTube in the past like 30 days. Um, it says January 29th, but it sucks. You, like, finals suck and... YouTube sucks, and I know you tried, so, I mean, if Illy wants to punish you tomorrow, she can, but I'm not going to. Um, alright, I hope you guys have a great week. Until I see you next week, and Illy, I'll see you tomorrow.